Hey everybody, I am the Executioner, and today we are going to be talking about a Shane Killian video, more like a live stream uh, snippet, where Chris Hagar and Shane Killian were talking about whether driving is a right or a privilege. Now, I would argue driving is a right when it comes towards if we're going to admit that there is a concept of a public road or a common road for people to travel on. Uh, in that case, then if it's public land and anybody can use it, why shouldn't anybody be able to drive? on it. As long as they are not hurting anybody, I don't see any reason why it shouldn't be a right. Now, if we are talking about private land, well, you as the property owner should have the right to uh, determine who drives on your road. And if part of that permission to drive on your road includes, well, you have to have a piece of paper saying that you are qualified to drive. Well, I don't see any problem with having a voluntary driver's license type thing uh, for private roads. Now, if we are going to have a uh, common road, then it would be more be like a right, if you think about it. That, I definitely agree with Shane Killian on. If a public road is to exist, then it should be a right, not a privilege. If it is a private road and it's private property, well, I think the property owner should determine um, who gets to drive on their uh, land, and if he wants people to drive on their land, uh, no requirements at all, then okay. But if he wants to have certain uh, requirements, he or she wants to have certain requirements for people to drive on their uh, his road, well, I think that it's only fair that the private property owner determines the rules of their own property. Uh, we can argue about this all day long, and personally, I think that if we are going to have a common road, uh, well, that should be a right, not a privilege. So, I agree with Shane on that. Uh, I, however, think there's a lot more nuance in whether we are talking about private roads, public roads, etc. And as a libertarian, can you really argue for a public road? If people voluntarily come together and say, okay, this road, anybody can use it, nobody really owns it, well, we can have public property in that instance. Private property, on the other hand, has to have a landowner, has to have uh, somebody who... Uh, who lays a claim to that land, they have a legitimate claim, and that's private property, and they should be able to determine who drives on their road, etc., etc. You can make a libertarian argument for uh, common property, you can make a libertarian uh, argument for property owned by no one. Anyways, hope you guys liked the video, please subscribe, have a wonderful week, and catch you on the flip side.